There you are with your fine self. So you're gonna show it to me, huh? You know what I'm talking about. Come on. You're gonna show me your, uh, you know, down there. You're gonna show it to me, huh? Yeah. So have you actually like showed a guy before? No. You know what? I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get your panties on my bedroom floor, right? If you want me to go and put on a cowboy hat and run laps around my house naked, I'll do it. And believe me, a guy running naked, that's like a girl running without a bra. I mean, that, I mean, that's very uncomfortable. Everything's bouncing up and down and banging off of each other. What? You want me to go down on my knees? Ah. Oh. You're gonna unzip your jeans? Yeah? All right. What? What do you mean your, your, your zipper won't go down? What? It's not, it's not going down. I, you know, I think I have a, a bottle of WD-40 in my basement. I can go get it right now and just, just give it a little spray. I, it should go right down. What? <laughs> You're just messing with me? Oh. Girl, don't mess with me like that. Oh. Honestly, I don't want this to end with me and blue balls, all right? So, I mean, come on, don't, don't tease me like that. All right, okay, okay, for real this time, all right? Okay, all right. All right, so unzip them, okay. Wow, black panties, huh? Wow, you know, I always thought, you know, if, if, if a girl's wearing white panties, it means like she's, she's like this innocent or whatever, right? But if a girl's wearing black panties, she means business. You're not one of these, these white panty girls that's just wearing black panties to, to pose as a black panty wearing girl when you're really a white panty wearing girl, right? I don't know what I'm talking about. I, okay, let me just help you get out of your, your pants there. All right, all right. <laughs> wow. Do you want to like uh, maybe like go on my bed and and just get get comfortable? You know, uh, you know maybe if you want to, you know, like don't don't pull them down yet. Just like you know, go over on my bed and and just just make yourself comfortable. All right? Okay. Yeah. All right. Now remember, okay? There's no rush to do this. All right? So just take your time. Okay, I don't want my rocket going off before the countdown begins, okay? So just, you know, pull your panties down really, really slowly, okay? I mean, just, there's no rush. Just pull them down really, really slow so I can, you know, I want to I wanna ease my way into this, all right? You know, so just pull them down really slow. I don't, I don't want to be shooting all over the room like a sprinkler, you know? All right, all right, all right, all right, please. Okay, so whenever, whenever you're ready, okay, I'm ready. Okay. All right, girl, I'm ready. Okay. So, whenever, whenever you're ready to to pull them down, I'm, I'm ready. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Wow. <laughs> Just calm down, man. Calm down, calm down. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Just calm down, calm down. Calm down, man. <laughs> China is so beautiful. <laughs> this is the first time I saw a vagina that wasn't a photograph on the internet. <laughs> I feel like I feel like when a when a Catholic person gets to meet the Pope. 
Your vagina is my Pope. <laughs> I've only ever seen vaginas on the internet and in, in, in magazines in, in, in 2D, but never in 3D like this. <laughs> Look at your pubic hair. You have it shaved like an airport landing strip. So beautiful. And you have a clitoris and everything. My friends always told me that a clitoris was fake, that it was some kind of a myth, it wasn't real. <laughs> but now I know, I know they do exist. <laughs> Finally, I see a vagina in real life. Finally. <laughs> what? Do I want to touch it? Yeah, 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 I, I, I want, I want to touch it, yeah. Yeah. You, you're sure? Yeah. It's kind of like a, like a, a wet marshmallow. Wow. It's so amazing. It's like it knows when it's supposed to get wet. <laughs> this is the most amazing, amazing time I've ever had. My, the most amazing part of my life. This is... This is absolutely fantastic. <laughs> what? Do do I want to finger it? Okay, pull, pull yourself together, man. Pull yourself together, okay? I'm sorry. Yeah, I want I want I want to finger it. <laughs> Up until this day, the only thing I ever fingered that even remotely came close to a vagina was an empty Kleenex box. <laughs> this is the happiest day of my life. Finally, finally I've seen a vagina in real life. And it's so beautiful. What? You, you want me to, to show you my thing? Um... <clears throat> About that, I, I think in in the heat of the moment, I I got overexcited, and I think I I already I I think I I already uh, arrived Met metaphorically. I I think I think I was I was running too fast, and, and I spilled my glass of milk. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You know if if uh, <clears throat> you know if uh, uh, you know you can go you can go watch TV and and come back and and say you know twenty minutes. You know I I'm sure I, I I'll I'll be up to the job. You know if you want if you want to go wait. You know I'm, I'm sorry, sorry about that. <laughs> I mean, I don't want you to get blue ovaries or or anything like that. Wait, wait, where, where are you going? You're not, you're not going home, are you? I mean, I, I, I mean, I mean, I, I said I was sorry. I mean, what, what do you want me to do here?
Wait, 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 don't go, don't go. Uh, don't tell my guy friends about this. You know, on the plus side, at least I won't have blue balls. <laughs>